Well, hello there. Welcome back to Piston Cup Productions, and today we're doing a video I never thought I'd ever get to do, and it is on the cancelled Precision Series Doc Hudson Clinic. Or is it? Okay, so backstory. This was on eBay for, I think, $900 or $850, somewhere around that price range. And someone on Facebook bought it, and I saw it on Facebook. You know, someone posted on a cars group, and it, I was just like, holy crap, that looks so real that looks exactly straight out of the movie like the canceled set that mattel was gonna make and so then i found the ebay seller contacted him and he makes these on order they are 3d printed with some handmade elements here and there no it did not come with doc this is just the one from my collection um it does not light up it is a scale replica basically imitating the one mattel canceled it is a little sensitive you gotta really be careful with it because you know you don't want to break anything it is handmade but i mean i'll tell you the detail on this thing is absolutely insane so we're gonna go through the set look at all the details and really appreciate how much these 3d printers and people can do looking at the actual base of the set i'm gonna have to take my camera off the tripod for a little bit so that you can just admire the detail that went into the floor work, and when you turn the set up a little bit here, I mean, look at like the rust and grime on the dirt and the windows and everything. The actual base itself, I'm gonna be very careful with this because I don't want some stuff falling. Yeah, but there's the base. I'm assuming this was all, yeah, 3D printed. I'm no expert. Maybe it's like soft foam, but yeah, the details are crazy i mean look at that even the little door swivel open but you just got to be careful with it or i think they're only oh uh, no 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 yeah i don't want to break it i'm gonna take the roof off it's better to push them out there we go yeah the floor is made out of paper as well so you really 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 got to be careful with this stuff here's the other side of the building very nice very nice so yeah i did buy this off of the seller maddie cars 95 i believe that's how you pronounce his name on Instagram so go check him out and his eBay store will be linked in the description of this uh, video but I mean he went above and beyond with this and he said he's making the courthouse soon so this won't be the end of you know reviews of us seeing his work for now are they expensive yeah but considering you know the 3d file and all the plastic material you I mean I don't think 3D material is cheap. I'm no expert on it, but... And then the labor that goes into it. And all those little details. I mean, I think this was worth it. Hopefully, I make at least a portion of the money back through this video. But now, I guess we can, like, dive into the actual detail. So when you lift up this roof right here... Oh, my goodness. I mean, just look at that detail, dude. I mean, everything is there, right? And, of course, if you grab some cars, you can, you know, put them on this little thing here. This little ramp or whatever. Hoist them up and Doc Hudson checks them out. You can fall right back down. This is custom made as well. Very, very nice. As I mentioned before, the, the floor is paper. But it has some nice little shine to it. Let me close that back up. Let me zoom out the camera a bit. I don't know why I'm so zoomed in. But really, the highlight of the set is the garage. Because, dude, the detail in here. My goodness. It goes crazy. You got the TV. It's removable. This is a separate piece. Thankfully, it's not bolted down or anything. Same with the camera down here. Or the... Yeah, I guess the camera. The old school camera. You can see a lot of the lines from the... 3d plastic the shelves the paperwork the books it does not have the piston cups <laughs> unfortunately but you at least have the the crash poster there from the first cars movie an extra barrel for some reason i don't really know why that's included and the doors that we saw earlier yeah, so you can really get some movie scenes 
recreated with these. I mean, that was the point of the Precision Series. You know, back when it was still going on, it was for you to collect authentic replicas of these buildings from the movie and recreate scenes like this for dioramas and stuff. I mean, it, it truly was something special. And then, I mean, they canceled it. It just really sucks that they canceled it due to poor sales. I mean, they were expensive sets, but they were super high in detail. And I mean, it's just unfortunate that not a lot of the retailers really jumped on purchasing these for their stores. It was only really Toys R Us and Amazon, I believe, that would sell these sets. And uh, now we rely on 3D printers to and files to hopefully complete the town one day. But, you know, it's bad on Mattel's part for canceling it, right? because you were so close to finishing. You just needed this building, Doc's Clinic, you know, the courthouse, and maybe McQueen's uh, little, like, or their little racing museum academy thing. Three buildings, man. If you don't count the abandoned ones leading up to the courthouse, just three more buildings. But I get it. Why would you produce something if it's not selling well, you know? But, man, it's just such a shame they had to cancel this, because they were also going to come out with a bunch of cars three items for the precision series not just cars one so they were going to do you know like dynamical cruiser mirrors intro ramon rusty's lightning mcqueen rusty's racing center lightning mcqueen and now it's all just canceled a couple years back they did sell those singles i just mentioned from cars three from a backdoor seller in china but those are all sold out i really wish i jumped on the opportunity while i still had the chance because they were selling them for cheap if i'm not mistaken and then these like gradually just started going up in price but oh man to have finished this collection it would have been incredible man i mean i can't wait till he releases the courthouse uh maddie cars 95 i think i'll definitely be purchasing it if this video does well and if people really want to see a review on that hopefully he comes out with it and it's to full scale because I don't think they've really done a courthouse to true scale. Same with Doc's Clinic. But now we finally have it and I mean, come on. Does it not look great? Anyways, just a quick little video. You know, there's not much to talk about. I don't really review the Precision Series that much or at least I don't do so anymore. I think I only really reviewed Flows at one point. But I mean... You know, since it's not an official set, there isn't much to go into detail besides, you know, the actual detail <laughs> and, you know, who made it and stuff. Just a final look at a lot of these details. I mean, it's really incredible. You know, once I build the little Radiator Springs town again, this will fit right in between Sarge's or right next to Sarge across uh, the Cozy Cone. Anyways, Piston Cup Productions signing out. It was a pricey little video to make, but hopefully you guys enjoyed